Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you so right. much. Good, to, good see to see you. All right. You know that old saying, it's good to be king. Is it good to be the most dangerous uh, guy in the room or guy in the situation? Is it fun to, to move the chess pieces the way you want to? Yes. I have never had as much fun. Honestly, and, and actually putting the show together was the same kind of experience for me. We had a, a chance to break the story together but with Farhad Safinia and uh, kind of figure out the, the type of person we were going to be playing and uh, the playing of it has been the most fun I've ever had. Thanks. Thanks, Andy. Yes? Well, you know what? It hasn't actually really started a lot of activity in terms of career because, honestly, I've been working at home so much uh, with my new life, and uh, I've been very happy about that. Uh, I sort of took a break after the, the filming of Boss, and I'm, I imagine there's bound to be some other th other stuff going on. But uh, right now, I'm, I'm really happy to we're gearing up for the second season of Boss. Um, my wife and I are expecting, so we're, you know, there's a lot on my plate. Thank you. Kelsey, to your right, uh, yeah. Sam Rubin from KTLA. How are you? Congratulations. Oh, hey, Sam. Good to nice see you, man. Nice to see you. Good to see you. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, you tell me the distinction between a, a, a small network like this, it's a big show and a great show, mm. but your other characters and your other work very widely seen. This not so widely seen. I, I imagine now you hope that this induces other Well, I would certainly, would certainly hope that more and more people will have a chance to see it, more eyeballs will find it, you know, but I, I think uh, over the next several seasons, uh, I imagine we'll garner quite an audience to, uh, audience share, and uh, it's a compelling story, you know, and when they are, it's fun to watch people find them. Thanks, Sam. Over here. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Mr. Grammer, right Yes, here. yes. Um, uh, one of HFPA's Twitter followers has this question. They want to know about your transition from drama to comedy. Uh, do you miss comedy? Oh, oh. Um, you know what, honestly, it's really the same thing. I mean, it's funny. Uh, they do say comedy is, you know, harder, but and it is for a, a lot of reasons, I think, because um, comedy, you have to have a kind of more skilled third eye while you're in the part at the same time. In this uh, role, I never watched dailies. I never thought about how I looked or what I was doing. I just allowed it to happen. So in some ways, that's much easier. Uh, the transition is simply just... It's the same work all the time. Uh, just sometimes you want people to laugh, sometimes you want them to cry, sometimes you want them to think, sometimes you want, to a want them to ask questions. It's, it's just a fun way to play a game, you know? <laughs> Thank you. Kelsey, you were talking about expecting again. Right yes. Here, sorry. Yes. How do you think fatherhood will be different the second time around, and how excited are you? Well, fatherhood's always different, you know, based upon the, the, the character that comes into your life. <laughs> I mean, they, uh, they arrive and tell you what you have to do. And uh, I'm really looking forward to meeting this, these new arrivals in our lives. I really am. Thank you. Arrivals, is that plural? Yes, it is. Twins. Wow. And what kind of mother do you think your wife will make? Extraordinary. She's already the most loving, amazing, warm human being I've ever met. She's funny and serious, scary and, and humorous all at the same time. She's an amazing person. And I think she'll, uh, I think she'll blow them away. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Oh, oh gosh. You know, the only thing, <laughs> I'll just be more tired, actually. <laughs> it doesn't really change your life except to, I mean, it wouldn't change the way I work, certainly. Uh, it just might change the amount of time I have to work. But uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to meeting them. Thank you. Um, Kelsey, besides children, what do you collect in life? Watches and books. That's, that's what I like, uh, old first editions and, uh, and the occasional watch. I'm not quite up to, not quite up to this one yet. This is a, a, a loner from Harry Winston, but <laughs> uh, we'll see. <laughs> it was really, really flattering, uh, honestly. It was, uh, we did take note of the fact that we got, got a lot of attention right out of the gate and uh, I just loved, I loved doing the job, and it was really nice to have people recognize it and say how, how much they appreciated it. Thanks. Good? 
Good. Thanks. Thank you, guys. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, sure. Hey. Thank you. Thanks a lot.